The John Monk Award 2023 goes to Stian Mitan, Patrick Breppel, and Klaus Walter for developing the intelligent dynamic drop application system, Ida Seal, leading to higher productivity, better quality, and material savings. Ida is a new technology and you could actually compare it like uh, printing a beat. You do it droplet by droplet and all these droplets together form a nice sealed beat. You can work with all angles, positions, distances, material flows and flow per second. So you can build up entire patterns with that. It gives a whole other level of freedom. You can create your own beat to fit it perfectly to your application that you need. It gives you the possibility to be as flexible as we have never been before. You save a lot of time and it can save a lot of material since the beat geometry itself allows you to put the droplets exactly where you want it, where you really need it. So this is one part of it due to the accuracy. So on the other hand, the beat itself has a typical geometric form which allows you to seal in a very thin layer. So the weight goes down, the applied material goes down, the waste material goes down. It's just more precision, less waste, less weight. Now we have the technology and I don't know where it ends. <laughs> we started with this PVC sealing and in the end it was really interesting to see that we could also transfer this new technology to this EV business that we are working in now, the battery shop. With the material wax is an application for corrosion protection. And EDA offers a technology where this corrosion protection can be as accurate as possible. Sometimes you need to seal a certain part of the battery, for example the screws. And this very defined patterns that the customer wants to achieve can be delivered by EDA. Yeah, it's a kind of future system. And of course the market reacted to this. Not only the customer reacted, also our competitors reacted, the entire market reacted. The market grows together with innovations and I think on EDA this happened. So in the end it is really interesting to see how these new innovations can help on shaping our future.